Imagine we have several elements on the page, like in this case. Some of these elements have a class matching. Let's say we want to find all elements with class matching and then confirm the text. And each text should be a string, so we want to confirm that we will have an array with three strings, first, third, and fourth. Here's how we can do it. First, we want to get the elements. We can use get with class matching, and we want to confirm first that we know that there are elements there. We can confirm the minimum number of elements, or in our case, we know that there should be three elements. Great. Now we know the elements are there, and now we need to extract the text from each element. Now what we get from get is a jQuery object. So we need to iterate over this object. Fortunately, there is a variety of methods that allow you to iterate over a jQuery object and extract inner text. My favorite is to use the jQuery make array. So from a jQuery object, it creates a plain array and then we can iterate. And now each item in that array is a plain DOM element and we can extract inner text from each one. Now we have an array and we use deep equal to confirm its contents. Contents, third, fourth. Every time you have objects or arrays, you have to use deep equal to compare them. Okay, great. Now it's a little bit verbose, so I will take advantage of another library that comes bundled with Cypress, and that's Lodash. So we can say map. And Lodash map is universal. It takes any collection, like in this case, it could be a jQuery object, and you can pass a callback, or you can just specify a property from each item that you want to extract when you iterate over that object. So this works the same way. And you can take this little utility that we've written and extract it into a utility function. So let's say get text and we'll pass that get text into the seven callback. For more examples like this, see the recipe get text from list of elements on my Cypress example site link from the description of this video.